right, so here in this rebuild, um, got a couple throttle bodies here. It did make a lot of sense to put it together with the same restrictions that it had before. So since I've already now done the valve job and the porting on the <clears throat> manifolds, this time I went ahead and ported the uh, inlet there at the throttle body, and this is the factory throttle body from Makuni, and it's um, you know 60 millimeters. And uh, I wasn't using the cooling uh, or <clears throat> heating, depending on how you think about it, for the throttle body, so that's all just tubed off. But this goes there. And I've ported that out as well, but what I'm going to actually do instead of using that is I'm going to try to use this 63.5 millimeter, which is about 12% larger by area throttle body, and it comes from a 2012 GT Eclipse which is a 3.8 liter V6. So it's a little bit bigger, but the, you'll notice like the connectors are basic, are exactly the same in terms of where they are in space. The shields are the same, the bolt pattern is the same. The difference is that um, this <coughs> GT1 has some sort of little bolt flange down here. Whereas that does not exist on the Evos throttle body, but I went ahead and fitted it up real quick. I don't have the transmission on over there, but um, I don't think it's going to interfere with it once I do get it on, because it doesn't stick down. These flange, <coughs> these flanges don't stick down any farther than the cooling water pipe would have for the Evo, so I really don't think that's, so this is the engine side over here, and this is the, uh, like, it radiator side, if you will. So that's not going to interfere with anything, I don't think. So I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing to this one as the other, which is to say I took the the gasket, lined it up with all the bolt holes, used a marker to outline <coughs> the ID of the gasket, and then that becomes my now OD that I want to, or the ID that I want to cut my throttle body to. So I'll cut that some more, and then I'll clean this up. This thing's seen some some use. And then uh, I will hopefully see if this fits up and, and works together.